One of the core features of DMNVX technology is that we're taking video and putting it onto the network. Now that raises all sorts of security implications. Now all of a sudden, the presentation that's being given to, to my CEO in my boardroom is on the network for anybody to access. So it was incredibly important to us to be able to bake security into the product. So it starts with encryption. All audio and video data is always protected using the AES encryption protocol. This is the same protocol used by banks to secure your financial transactions, by government to secure, uh, secure communications. So while that's great, it's really not enough. You need to make sure that the devices on the network are the devices that were intended to be installed on that network. 802.1x is the protocol used to do that. With built-in 802.1x support, we're able to ensure that the devices on the network are those blessed by the AV integrator or by the IT department, and not some device that was brought in from outside that could decrypt the content itself. Taking it a step further, we're bringing Active Directory integration to NVX, as well as many other Crestron products. Active Directory integration lets us centrally manage administration privileges for the box. Of course, every box needs a username and password, but if that username and password is shared among lots of people, security starts to fall apart quickly. So by using the Active Directory integration, we can centrally manage who can log into the box at given times. If people leave the group, they can be removed from the administration privileges. Just another way that NVX is more secure. So, in summary, the stakes are much higher now that video is on the network, but DMNVX has you covered with AES encryption, 802.1x authentication, and Active Directory integration.